member for Saanich Gulf Islands. Mr. Speaker, on Saturday, at every single law school in Canada, students volunteer doing research to figure out how they can help refugees potentially affected by President Trump's attempt to stop their flight to safety. Now those same law students, starting at the University of Victoria, picked up on by University of Toronto, University of Alberta, Dalhousie Law School, have written this government to ask for the immediate suspension of the safe third party agreement. Can the Prime Minister, as our Prime Minister and the Minister responsible for youth, hear and heed their voices? The Honourable, right Honourable Prime Minister. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. We are a country of immigrants, and Canada, Canadians have always acted with compassion to those seeking safety for themselves and their families. We will continue to welcome people in need of protection. As I've often said, Canada is stronger not in spite of our differences, but because of them, and that's why it was so, uh, such a source of pride that so many Canadians worked so hard to welcome over 46,000 refugees just last year. We will continue to do everything we can uh, to welcome people to Canada because we know that makes us better, that makes us stronger, that makes us better off. Colleagues.